Good morning, guys. You're just going to have to excuse me looking worse for wear. I honestly feel like I've been hit by a bus today. I had a really bad night's sleep. I'm just waiting on like a Zoom class to connect with Frank Body. I've never done like a Zoom meeting before, so I'm really hoping I've done it right. I'm pretty sure I'm muted. I can hear that someone isn't, <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I am. Um, I don't want to show you guys all the random people on there because I think customers are on there too. So we're just going to wait for that to start. But good morning. Hi. Hello. Um, I'm just doing some random things this weekend. Whoop. Let me just tilt the camera down. So I thought I would just vlog. Um, I've got some things to unbox for the little bubba's room. I've also got a Bissell spot clean that I really want to demo out on some dog pee stains on our mattress. Um, they're very old stains, so I'm not sure how it's going to go, but I really want to put it to the test. So that's what's on the agenda today. I'm not sure how intense this class is going to be. I believe it's like exercise related. Um, so while we're waiting for this class to start, I'll unbox this new goodness I got in the mail. I have a yoga mat in here <sighs> from stretching. Uh, Zoom classes are so funny how people connect with video. It freaks me out. Like all these random people I've never seen in my life, so I better not show them. Um, okay, so I received a really beautiful delivery from Bell Living and Co. Bell and Co. Living, sorry. Um, I'm going to leave them linked in the description box, but they have like beautiful, absolutely stunning, like kitties things. So toys, um, room decor, clothing, um, everything pretty much you could think of they have when it comes to baby related stuff and um, they sent me out their beautiful large size trunks for Okay, so these are the trunks. So I'm going to get them all set up. Um, probably over in that corner where the camera is actually. Um, but I'm just going to quickly tune in to this little this little exercise sesh with Frank. And then um, I'll come back to you guys. I could definitely like do the body rolls still. That's good for the hips, right? Oh yeah, work out those hips. Oh yeah. <laughs> Shake it! Woo! <laughs> Look at it! It's 305 Fitness! They dance! It's dance exercise! Oh, you come in at the end! On my video! And I'm just like... <laughs> <Show me>. <laughs> Bye bitches. Love you. I mean look I had to call it quits on the 305. Not quite limber enough. Messy ass kitchen. 
also um, a new pregnancy craving I have is Hungry Jack's Big Jack. It is absolutely better than a Big Mac. And um, I'm ashamed to admit this, but I've actually had four this week. Don't judge me. Pregnancy cravings, when you get them, are like out of this world. But I'm going to be healthy this morning and make this smoothie. Um, so I have been drinking my peppermint tea religiously, but <laughs> I've been needing some extra help. So the only way I can stomach Metamucil is if it's in a yummy smoothie. Otherwise, I can't do it. And even then, it makes your smoothies like kind of like gelatiny. Mmm, that's good. I'm trying to have a smoothie every day. Please ignore my messy room. It's a pink star, but we're about to get the bistle out. And I'm going to strip the bed and wash all the bedding today as well because it's a really nice day outside. So, good day to do some lawn break. That's how you know you're getting old when you get like a nice day and you're like, oh, great day to strip the bed and wash all the bedding. <laughs> Now, when I show you the stains on my mattress, please don't judge me <laughs> because they're really bad. They're not from me wetting the bed though, they're from the dogs. And I never used to have like waterproof mattress protectors on our bed because, well, I'm not prone to wetting the bed, neither's Brett. And, you know, I guess you just kind of think of that like for little kids beds i suppose yeah well you should probably have it if you're going to have dogs sleep on your bed too oh these pee stains are so bad hi there okay let me just get this stuff into the laundry and then i'll show you the pee stains <gasps> oh gosh <laughs> Oh, so bad. So as you can see, she's clearly peed here multiple times. There's a little stain there too. Um, and then there's one up here and one over there. Oh, my gosh, it is actually disgusting. Oh, I can't even deal. I actually really hope it does help lift that stain because it's so foul. Um, so, oh. So if you're cleaning up something that's chunky, like maybe you're cleaning up a child's vomit, you'd want to use this attachment that has its own little separate um, tank. And then these two heads, I believe, are essentially the same. You've just got a 15 centimeter one and an eight centimeter one. So for bigger messes, use the wider one. For smaller messes, use the smaller one. So I think I'll use the small attachment. And then it's just got one on and off button. Okay, Ooh. <laughs> I'm excited. All right, let's get this going then. Ew. <laughs> I mean, I know my thing's still stained, but that literally looks like actual piss. Oh my god. So although the stain definitely isn't 100% removed, I think it has certainly helped. And based on the colour of the water that came out of that machine, it's like I sucked up pee, honestly. So I think maybe I just need to go over it a few more times or maybe I should also invest in their actual like spot treatment that you spray it with 
before you use the Bissell. So I might try to get some of that and I'll do it again next week and see if I can get these stains out because that's definitely a little bit better. The back one, maybe not so much. Oh, maybe it is. I don't know. I'm going to have to compare like a side-by-side -side of the before and this. Um, it's nearly like it's drying down. It's still a little bit wet, but it's definitely drying down now.